It's Deepavali, and the craving for some authentic Indian cuisine is back with the Festival of Lights. On this special Chom Chom campus, we bring you on a food trail in Little India to find the best Indian food. Little India is the center of the Indian community in Singapore. It's located at Serangoon Road and is well known for both southern and northern Indian cuisine. Most of these restaurants are located near Said Albi Road, which is just opposite popular 24-hour retailer, Mustafa Center. Our first stop is Chela's Sizzling Corner. Most of the dishes here are served on hot plates to ensure that the food remains nice and warm. A staple in every Indian cuisine is the biryani, the set of rice-based food filled with spices, rice and meat. For those craving to charm into something new, how about the palak chicken? The chicken is not served with your usual sauces, but in a creamy sauce and rich with spices, spinach and milk. If you're looking for a solely vegetarian meal, head down to Ananda Bhavan. The restaurant claims to be the first vegetarian eatery in the vicinity. Here at Ananda Bhavan, you can find a wide variety of tose, another popular Indian dish to satisfy your taste buds. Tose is a common breakfast dish and street food made from rice batter and black lentils. How about some vegetable curry to go with that tose? Vegetable curry is usually less spicy in comparison with your meat curries but equally tasty. Next up is Sakuntala's Food Palace. According to bestmakan.com, it is one of the restaurants which known for serving healthy dishes. What is Indian food without curry? Sakuntala is known for their wide variety of curries to go with whatever dish you order, be it biryani, tose or prata. Another specialty here at Sakuntala is their tandoori chicken. If you want something hot and spicy, then this is the dish for you. <laughs> Lastly, we take a look at another vegetarian restaurant, Balgi Bawan. A popular dish at this restaurant is their mix and match platter. Grab a big plate and choose from a variety of dips for a healthy meal. Here you can also find Ras Malai, a sugary dessert. If you want something more familiar, then try out the traditional Indian ice cream, also known as Kulfi. So there you have it. Four different restaurants with different varieties of food and one thing in common. Everything can be found at the endless belt of restaurants that seem to go on and on all around Little India. Head down to Little India this coming Deepavali and get a taste of the festivities with these Indian delicacies. <laughs>